Hello and welcome to PlayStation Grenade. It's time to bust more myths in Fortnite. As always, if you have a question for the myth chasers to test, please put it in the comments below and your myth could be chosen on next week's episode. Please think about using code Adamaru if you like this series, it helps keep the lights on. So the helicopter was added in Fortnite this week. Instead of starting with a brand new myth, we're going back in time to about four weeks ago because this is too good to ignore. Get your eye holes around this. Shadow agents can unlock ghost doors. It's a good myth. Can the face recognition software be fooled by an enemy henchman? In the past we've tried this, but every time we got close, the henchman would vanish into thin air. But now the chopper is here. Can we claim a shadow henchman, take them all the way to the agency and open a sealed door? Here's how it's going down. Two of us went to Pleasant Park to get a henchman and the chopper under the field, while two others went to the agency and cleared a path for us. It was going to be tight in terms of timing, but we were confident. And guess what? See for yourself. Myth confirmed. Shadow henchmen can indeed open ghost doors. To really flex on this myth, we went the opposite direction, taking a ghost henchman to a shadow weapons cache. And check this, it works perfectly. We did this multiple times to really confirm this myth, and it all comes down to those lovely choppers in the sky. Damn, I'm impressed. Now let's keep this going, next myth. Friendly bots will use a chopper. Hmm, I like this. Into battle labs we go. You'd think this would be super easy, wouldn't you? Well, check out what happens. Every single grenade and bot inside completely ignores the chopper and simply runs away from it. To counteract this, I thought I was being smart. I built a wall to force them into the chopper. And what do you think they did? They pickaxed the chopper to get around it. <laughs> Bad times. So myth busted, bots will not use choppers. So then we had to try this with decoys. This is also a fail. When thrown down, they run away from the chopper. And get this, throwing decoys inside the chopper causes this to happen. Absolutely nothing at all. The decoy never even appears, making the decoy grenades terrible flashbangs. Rip the dream. Next myth. Well, well, this is more of a question actually. What happens to the chopper at Steamy Stacks? I had high hopes that the chopper would be held up by the steam, but this is what actually happens. Well nothing. The updraft slows the chopper slightly, but to no avail, it can descend here and it can even be at rest on top of the purple stuff. What a letdown. It's actually a bit of a bugger to get back in once you've parked this thing, so pro tip, watch out for the propellers. Here's a weird myth. A falling boat will destroy a chopper. What do you think to this? I got my backside over to the docks and set up the chopper under the boat held up by a crane. Will the boat cause the chopper to explode? Let's see. Nope. Wow. Wow, that was that was totally anticlimactic. Myth busted. Let's crack on. Jody MC says It's possible to hide C4 inside a chopper and explode it later in the game. Okay, so there's two parts to this myth. First, let's see if it's possible to hide C4 inside the helicopter. And look at this, it certainly is possible to hide it here. Normally the C4 sticks out in plain sight, but if we throw it at the back seat, there's a chance that it will be completely out of sight and out of mind. The second part of the myth was to explode the C4. As you'd expect, it works really well from close distance, but the C4 has a range limit. To test it to the extreme, we flew to opposite sides of the island to attempt the longest distance kill in Fortnite history. But sadly, it did not trigger. The C4 was still functional when shot, but the signal needs to be close enough to manually trigger the explosives. Another note is where the C4 is placed matters a great deal. We found that smashing the pilot screen and throwing C4 in there is the most OP spot on the choppers. Every day is a school day. Next myth. Can explosive barrels be thrown onto the chopper? Oh no, it says thrown into a chopper. Okay, okay, good myth. Let's try it. 
One part of this myth can be debunked immediately. If you attempt to throw an explosive container into the chopper, well, it's like hitting a brick wall. It bounces straight back out again. So this is where we changed our attempt. We are going to change our plan. We attempted to land the canister on the side panel. And check this out, we got it to land. So, myth confirmed. Well, cut, cut the music, cut the music. We have an issue. The moment the canister lands, it holds the chopper in place, making flying away impossible. When the helicopter did get clear, the canister floated in mid-air. Just stayed there, spooky. And more often than not, the chopper's rotor blades would cause an explosion. So this is a busted myth gutted. We double checked this just in case it was because the helicopter was touching the ground and no, the same thing happens when you throw it on an airborne helicopter. Next myth! Can you land a bottle flip on a chopper? I like the way you think. Yeah, bottle flip myths. Check this out. We found out that to have a chance at this, the helicopter must be even and steady. And then with enough attempts, it finally happened. The bottle flip on a chopper is mastered. I had hoped to fly this around the map, but look what happens. The bottle falls through the helicopter and lands absolutely perfectly on whatever's underneath. This is all pointless information, but I had fun all the same. Next myth. Reese Brady asks, can a chopper catch a supply drop? Well, this one's for you, dude. Off I ventured into the world, waiting to pounce on any unsuspecting supply drop. I had such an unlucky time. Everyone that spawned was so far away, it made it almost impossible to get there in time. Luckily, I found two. The first I encountered, I attempted to catch in mid-air. I found that the supply drop bounced me away instantly. I tried again from above, and to my surprise, the balloon burst. So a chopper can cut down supply drops. I then tested the strength of a supply drop against the chopper blade, and by far, the supply drop wins. So I ran away to find another. On this one, I attempted to land on top. Epic fail, moving on. Now here we go, this one was perfect. A perfectly flat floor to catch the drop. I took out a tree trying to cause issues and waited in the perfect spot for the drop. Could we catch it? Well, here we go. Absolute perfection! Bang in the center point. I defended the drop with my life until the moment came to fly away. Could we lift the drop? And... No, but hey, myth proven, we can catch a supply drop on a chopper. GG. Our next myth is a functional one. Campfires heal choppers. I like it. So off I ran to the agency and partially destroyed the chopper there. I then took it to a fire pit. Would it work? And look at this, it works perfectly. The chopper loved its day out. It acted like a puppy eating dinner, healing by the campfire. Useful to know, isn't it? Anyway, 10 minutes later, I had fully restored the chopper. It was good as new. So let's go back to that hole in the chopper. Check out this myth. We can rocket ride through a chopper window. Wow, we gotta start small on this one. Let's build up to this. First, we tested if grenades could pass through, and they totally can. Next step, we tried proximity mines, and nope, they, they get stuck. So sometimes this is a solid, sometimes it's a complete hole. So here's the moment of truth. Can we fly a rocket through there? And yes, it works perfectly. So let's quickly bring in another myth. A rocket can travel through multiple helicopters. So we lined it up, three choppers. Do you think the rocket will make it through all three? Check it out. Damn, that was epic. Good myth. So now's the time. Let's rocket ride through this window. Here we go. What the hell was, what's, what is this? We tried again, and again, and again, and uh oh, the rocket flies through, but there is something preventing a player from going through that hole. It is completely blocked, we cannot enter the back seats. Devastating. Please Epic Games, if you see this, remove that solid object. We need to fly through nine choppers. It has to be done. In replay mode, this is what happens when you absolutely nail the positioning. 
it just vanishes. <laughs> Why? Why? So sadly, this is a busted myth. But there is a use for this. If you need to quickly get up to a chopper, you can use a rocket and easily land on the side of the helicopter. So every cloud has a silver lining or whatever the hell they say. So there we have it. Those are the myths for this week. If you've got another one, throw it in the comments and please upvote your favorites to make it easier for me to spot them. On screen now are the people who are kind enough to use my code in the Fortnite shop. It means the absolute world to me. I say this every week, but I mean it. You're all legends. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you so much for your time. I'm Adam from PlayStation Grenade. You're awesome. Stay that way. See ya.